Buram and Sepang Sugo, Mandalika, Zuhai and Buram again. Different courses all. Here is the starting grid. Noguchi for SDG, MS Hawk Pro on P1. Reiterberger. Aslan looked in very competitive uh, mood yesterday uh, before the mechanical problems forced him out. And we are on board here with uh, Hiroki Noguchi. He's in P2, looking backwards on Kunamine. 25, Aslan Shah, jump start, ride through penalty. Oh, we were saying he made a good start, but perhaps it was a little bit too good. So, ride through penalty. P6, Kazma Daniels down in P10. That's right. He's got uh, Kazuki Akiyoshi just behind him. Yeah, not uh, not such good good start for... P2 uh, and 3. Interesting to see where Kazma Daniel is. If yeah, he's on a quick lap currently he's just gone ahead of Kota Arakawa yesterday in the wet and then went off the pace just a little bit yeah we know Haruki Noguchi is good late in the race he's uh, pretty aggressive at the middle of the race as well by the looks of things well yeah he likes to lead from the front but uh, but I think he manages his not time. on this circuit Haruki Noguchi came into this round looking for a double win looking to take home advantage to consolidate his championship position and there goes Kazma same, same place. place under breaking for that treacherous turn one the front gets halfway turned uh, the front just slips away he's had three p3s uh, sorry three p4s and two p5s andy farid currently he's in p4 both kota arakawa and andy farid were in the 600 race kota arakawa was the uh, was the story of the weekend in this in uh, the super sport class uh, who is a good seven and a half seconds from Takuma Kunamine. And it's just a case, I think, for Reiterberger of not making any mistakes. Barry, and he's too experienced for that, surely. He's too experienced. He was at uh, another sweeping circuit with uh, elevation changes and all kinds of challenges for 24 hours last weekend in Belgium. Go to Arakawa if it's at all possible. So Asia Dream looking for a 2-3 position on the podium. That would be beyond their dreamings at the start of the day. As they come up, final lap. Marcus Reiterberger is 17.8 seconds clear. He is slowing down. He is cruising. He's waving to the crowd as he goes around almost Marcus Reiterberger. In the meantime, 17 seconds ahead of them coming up the hill and into the chicane for the final time is an outstanding performance from Marcus Reiterberger. I cannot recall such a dominant performance. Yes, circumstances went his way, but dominant from the moment he took the lead, Marcus Reiterberger, a wheelie to celebrate, and a victory for Marcus Reiterberger, extends his lead at the top of the championship. Behind him, this is the battle for P2, and it'll be Andy Farid Isdahar to take it for Indonesia, the head of Zach Wanzadi, Honda Asia Dream with Showa pick a P2 and P3. Kota Arakawa will be fifth in the overall championship standings. But it's Germany, Indonesia and Malaysia. Reiterberger on the BMW, followed by the Honda. There is the margin of victory, 17.8 seconds from Andy Farid. So one XOX BMW TKR team.